Minnesota is a destination for people who love to play in the outdoors, but now it's also becoming a destination for filmmakers. Northern News Now's Larissa Millis got a first-hand look today on a set up in Ely. Far away from the rolling hills of Hollywood, filmmakers are flocking to Minnesota. A current production, the coming-of-age film with the working title Boundary Waters, is shooting in Ely. It is a perfect match. It's a perfect match for the story. The developing film industry is thanks in part to Minnesota's expanding film tax credits and incentives. In this session, the legislature expanded the current 25% tax credit cap of $5 million to $25 million and extended the program for the next eight years. This means productions can get a 25% tax credit if they spend at least $1 million on eligible production costs in the state. This opens up so many more opportunities for many producers and the film community and industry within the state. Those incentives are a draw for filmmakers like Aaron May Miller, the producer of Boundary Waters. That is a huge incentive for filmmakers to really put in the legwork to actually plan to shoot somewhere, is to have um, security in funding of a tax credit or an incentive. Film productions bring a boost to the local communities as well. They've been using our resources, and that is definitely an important thing, um, not just for Ely, but for the Ely area, and also for the entire um, northeast, northeastern range area. Ely Mayor Heidi Omerza says the production came to town at a perfect time with Ely tourism in its off season. It's a great time for us to have actually people come to Ely and um, the, the economy is a little bit slower. So that was awesome. Bright lights putting a spotlight on a little city. Thank in Ely, you. Larissa Millis, Northern News Now. And that film doesn't have a release date yet. Producers hope to have it travel through the film festival cycle before being released in theaters or on a streaming service.